Here is a quick proof that 1 is the largest positive number. What we're going to do is set n equal to the largest positive number and show that n must be equal to 1. To start, observe that every time you square a number, it becomes larger. Since this is true for every single number, it must also be true for n. So we have n is less than or equal to n squared. Now, because n is the largest positive number, we also have that n squared is less than or equal to n. So if we combine these two inequalities, we get n is less than or equal to n squared, which is less than or equal to n. The only value that n squared can have is if it's equal to n. Now the only positive number that is its own square is 1. Therefore, n must be equal to 1. But this is clearly not true. So where is the mistake? The mistake is actually at the very start where we defined n. Since there is no largest positive number, every step we do after we define n becomes invalid.